Welcome back to Funko Madness. We're going to be looking at Loki. I know, I know, we usually do have a Loki in this, but it's time he gets an upgrade. So we're looking at the gold Loki, well gold helmeted Loki, from I believe Thor in the Dark World, or it might just be regular. Let's take a look at what he looks like. And as always, Funkos are just so fat. he just didn't even want to stay. He just wanted to come out really badly. So of course, it is Loki with his helmet. And you can see he's got a bit of a shine on him, which is very, very nice. I am liking this, and he is very, very wobbly headed. You can just hear it. He's got a very heavy head because of the helmet, which is not a bad thing. His paint is very good, except for in a few spots, as we can see right here seems like it's just a little bit messed up right there but ooh, that's really messed up looks like it's just excess paint oh well it's a very nice figure but let's give him the stand and then the shake test shall we he seems to stand a bit better than regular loki he still has the depressed loki syndrome look at him he still kind of wobbles and looks down now let's give him the test he does survive the shake test, that's for sure. So if you guys are a huge fan of Loki, I believe you can still get him if you're lucky at Hot Topic, or he might already, and then he fell over. Loki had a bit too much mead, but you can pick him up at, I believe, Hot Topic or a couple of other places. The only place I've seen him was Hot Topic. He's a really, really nice figure, and uh, yeah. I'd say, if you're a Thor fan or a Marvel collector person, then grab them. Unfortunately, I don't have the others to show off, but hey, join me next time for another toy review. I'm thinking we're going to keep with the Marvel here. So see you next time for a Guardians review. Bye, everyone.